everybody. For today's Field Trip Friday, we are going to talk about two of my favorite photographers, Claude Calhoun and Marcel Moore. Now, they were alive at the beginning of the 1900s. So one thing to know is that photography was a lot different back then, right? So photography in the 1900s, not like today. Today, we can carry a digital camera around in our pockets and take a picture of anything and have it instantly. Back then, you needed a whole room just to develop a single photograph. And that process required things like chemicals and running water and a knowledge of how to use those chemicals, right? And how to use light because you would have to keep this room completely dark as you tried to develop your photo. So it was quite a bit more work than what we do today where we can just point our phones at something and click to get a picture. Now, as you can see, these pictures are pretty unusual, right? And that's because Claude Calhoun and Marcel Moore they liked to participate in something called the surrealism movement. And surrealism was all about exploring the unconscious mind. So they were really trying to make their images feel dreamlike or surreal. Claude Calhoun and Marcel Moore, the reason I keep mentioning them together is because they actually worked together on their artwork and they lived together too. These two were in love. They spent their whole lives basically with each other. Um, the other really cool thing about Claude Calhoun and Marcel Moore is that they were activists. So like I said, they were born in the late 1800s and lived through the early 1900s. And during the 1940s, when World War II happened, they would create anti-Nazi propaganda, and then they would disguise themselves. So these people were spies. They were artists and spies who were in love and they would distribute this anti-Nazi anti propaganda, these pamphlets that said things about Nazis like, we hate you, go back to where you came from, we don't want you here, Nazis. And they would go and give them to actual Nazis. Now keep in mind, this was really dangerous for them, not only as gay people, but as somebody standing up to the people in power. And they were eventually imprisoned for this. And they would spend their time in prison trying to give other prisoners hope. They never lost faith that they were going to be okay, that they were going to make it out the other side of this. And eventually they did. So anyway, that's on Claude Calhoun and Marcel Moore, two of my favorite artists. And this was really only the tip of the iceberg about them. I wish I could talk to you about them forever, but unfortunately I have to keep this video short. So if you're interested, I encourage you some time to do some more research on these two. And I hope that you're having an awesome day. Bye.